Hello, I'm Necro, and today I'm going to take you through the Seeds and Adventures Tome items of Stern. Timestamps will be in the description, so without further ado, let's begin. We're going to start out at the Municipal District Triport. So Stern has a ton of auxiliary areas and corridors. For instance, the Town Hall up here is basically an area in and of itself. So to begin, we're going to come in here and head towards the Repair Merchant. And just to its right, we're going to find our first Makoko Seed. Now we're going to head down the hallway into Bastion and Sasha's room. Over here in the left corner of their room, you're going to find another seed. Out of these two, Sasha is definitely the preferred one to build rapport with first because she has some really incredible rewards like the third giant's heart and a bunch of gold. As always, I will be leaving more information about them in the description. And that'll be alongside of Neria and Mercenary Zayra who are at these two locations on the map, and the Wandering Merchant of Arthatine who I will always suggest you buy the rapport items from so that you can max out these rapports faster. Now we're going to run a little bit further back into the town hall and take a left. Up here in the top corner, behind the couch, we're going to find another seed. Then we'll visit the other two rooms, grabbing a seed in the northeast room here, and another in the southeast room here. Then we'll try for it back to the municipal district, and move down these stairs to the south, taking a left at the bottom, coming to the regulator headquarters right here. And going in. Over here in this left side room, we're going to find another seed. Now we're going to head to the business district. At right here, between the gold cellar and storage, we're going to be able to walk into this building. And from the entrance, if you go right and hug the wall around, you're going to find a seed in the corner. Now leave and head just a little bit to the left. Until you see another door you can walk into, but don't go in. If you check the corner behind this man, you'll start the answer to the agony hidden story. We'll be finishing that as we go, but first we're going to head north a little bit and hang left. Coming to just about right here, where we'll find another seed. Now we're going to head to the market district. And from the triport, we're going to go to the right and walk down these stairs. Just beside of the gold shop here is another investigate option. This will give you number two of four. Then we're going to come back up to Neria's Tavern and head inside. And in the very north corner behind the stage, we're going to find another seed. Next, we'll walk back outside of the tavern and talk to the cooking ingredient merchant Melina. She sells the Syken Combat Ration Type A, which we need for our cooking items. Drop the 30k silver and add it to the tome. Opposite her, we're going to find another merchant, Deberry. They sell the Unknown Crystal, which we're going to buy 22 of. Then you'll take those and come to the left and talk to the Cooking Master. What we want to do here is craft the Boiling Liquid. To do that, we're going to need 5 specific ingredients out of the 23 listed. The count goes 3, 4, 5, 6, 4. And the ones that you want are the first one on the list. Then count down to number 5 on the list and craft the 4 of those. Then count down to the 14th one on the list and craft 5 of those. Then come down to the 17th one, this one's easy because it has a different naming convention than the ones before it, and craft 6 of these. And then the 5th ingredient is the final one on the list here and you'll only need 4 of those. But once you get all of the ingredients you need, you can just craft this boiling liquid. But then you'll want to leave it in your inventory for a few minutes until it cools. And once it changes, you're going to be able to add the unknown liquid XD6353 to your adventurer's tomb. I managed to run into Nox here in the Windbringer Hills at the guard post. Eventually you will have to find him in order to grab the adrenaline boosting fluid, which is only 777 silver, which you'll also bring back here to craft the boosting fluid soup. And as mentioned, I'll leave his schedule and a link to the locations of where you can find him in the description down below. Alright, once you get that, we're going to head west away from the tavern. Coming to right here just before the bend. It's a little bit obscured, but right here is another seed. Now we'll head to the center ring, and right here, we'll go down this stair icon. This will take you to this giant ring looking map, and over here on the left side, we'll find yet another seed. Now head out the way you came, and we'll head towards the arid path, stopping right here just before the portal, so that we can grab the panorama of the city vista. Now we can come to the Industrial District Triport. We'll go south and then east, heading towards the east wall, stopping at right here, 
and checking behind this fence for a really darkened seed. Then head just a little bit north to right here and examine this console to get the answer to Agony 3 of 4. Continue along this path until you come to the Hall of Transcendence right here, then enter. Then we're going to walk upstairs and head to the left, where in the corner of this room to the right is another seed. Then on the opposite side of the same room as the seed, we're going to investigate this bookcase to start the greatest evolution form hidden story. Cross the hallway into the other room and investigate the end of this desk for number two of three. Then we're going to walk all the way to the back right to this little circular room where we'll investigate these tubes and that will finish the greatest evolution form hidden story. To finish up, we're going to head back to the business district triport and we're going to go down these stairs to Stern's lower level. That'll spit you out right here. We're going to loop around to the other side of those stairs and come up to the top here. And at right here, if we check behind this grate, we're going to find another seed. Then we'll make our way to the south corner about right here, where you'll find the final terminal to finish up the answer to the agony. And that will wrap up Stern. Thanks for watching. If this video helped you at all, please consider leaving a like, subscribe if you'd like to see more, and let me know if there's any feedback you have down in the comments. We'll be heading to the Windbringer Hills next, so until then, that'll be all for me. See ya!